In this video, I'm going to share with you the easiest cover three beater in Madden 22 right now. What's going on, guys? I just can't wait to share this video with you because I think you're going to actually find that this is a really, really good concept, not just for its ability to be, to be able to beat cover three, but it's also just a good play in general. Uh, so I'm super excited to break this down for you. Now, if you're new to the channel, be sure to subscribe. Uh, I post new videos every single day on, on YouTube. Uh, so make sure that you're subscribed. Also, if you haven't subscribed to my TikTok yet or followed my TikTok, there should be a link in the description. Go follow my TikTok. I post every single day, 60 seconds or less video tips. Um, if you guys don't want to have like the long drawn out videos, you can get access to those as well. So uh, this is honestly really, really simple. All we're going to do is we're going to pick the play Bunch Trail out of the uh, Seattle Seahawks offensive playbook. If you have not got my Gun Bunch offensive guide, I would really encourage you to get that. We're going to be updating it over the course of the next week or so with some new concepts post-patch that are really, really effective uh, for cover three as well as some other coverages that we found uh, that they actually made worse in the patch. So that being said, bunch trail out of the seattle playbook if you want to get my offensive guide there's a link in the description you can get it for just 15 bucks now it only requires one adjustment all we're going to do is put circle on a fade that's literally it snap the ball as fast as possible and what you're going to see here is as soon as that corner route turns to the sideline the outside corner is going to turn his hips and you're going to be able to beat cover three over the top for a one play score now what's also really really cool is let's say for example um that they want to make an adjustment like put this outside corner in a deep half if they put that outside corner in a deep half now your outside corner route is going to be wide open as well now i will also say that if they press coverage and they use a deep half uh, most of the time that deep half is still going to get glitched out as you see right Right there we're gonna beat him right off the press for a one play score that's Antonio Brown he's not exactly the fastest guy in the game but as you can see it's getting wide open so this is honestly a super great uh, play now we can make this even better with a couple of other adjustments what I like to do is I like to slide protect to the right I like to delay fade my tight end and I'll typically double team that outside linebacker and then I'll put my running back on an in route and I'll put that uh, that 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 uh, fade route to circle out there and what you'll see is i'll go ahead and show this with that safety to the bunch side just so that you can kind of see the concept because we have this post route over here um that time right there man that sucks i i don't know how that happened that's just practice mode being practice mode to be honest with you because we're blocking six and somehow we still got instantly shedded by a defensive tackle that has like a 77 overall so uh kind of annoying but anyways what you're going to see here is that circle receiver just pass lead that up brady's not gonna be able to make the throw on the run i don't know how i'm getting pressured out of my freaking face um good old madden 22 man um these 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 things you can't make this stuff up so i'm just spying the rush because i just want to show you this one concept you're not going to get this kind of pressure in game this delay fade will pick up every blitz from three through five wide um for the most part and then as i said see right there just pass lead that to the right that's why you put him on a fade and as you can see one play touchdown so it's easiest cover three beater and what's also really cool about this is you can come out in your gun bunch to the wide side everybody would expect you to run this to the wide side so you could go ahead and you know just go about setting up your play as you see right here i've kind of set my play up now i'm just going to flip the play on them and then just basically snap the ball as fast as humanly possible and they're not going to be able to adjust their defense they really aren't and as you can see i mean that's insanely effective so thanks for watching the video we have so many of these one play scores and stuff like that broken down in our gun bunch offensive guide and what's cool about our gun bunch guide is it's not just the gun bunch in the seattle playbook it's the gun bunch in every playbook so we literally break down carolina miami new england um uh the seattle uh washington and on and on and on so if you want to get the best gun bunch in the game we broke down all of them for you and you can choose which one you like the best so um really really enjoy uh this offense this year this offense is insane so if you want to learn how to run it and learn how to run different versions of it i would encourage you to get our gun bunch offensive ebook there's a link in the description below you can get that entire offense for just 15 bucks